On August 24, 1998, science fiction and conspiracy theory met science fact when the first successful human implant of a radio tracker was tested in the UK. Called Radio Frequency Identification, or RFID, the device consists of a miniaturized radio transponder that, when interrogated by a RFID reader, sends identifying information to that reader, usually a coded number that is interpreted as whatever identity of person is assigned to the implant. Far from the conspiracy theory systems that allow satellites to observe and report on the location and movement of people with implants, for the device to work, the reader must be quite close to the person with implants in order to identify the device within several meters. Another form of implant that is passive and does not require a battery of its own can be read by an RFID reader from up to hundreds of meters away.